Hi from IK Multimedia. We are proud to present you the newest version of our legendary mixing and mastering tool, t rex 6. t rex 6 not only brings eight new models, but also unique features that will help your workflow. We'll start from what sets us apart, the mastering console. The mastering console is a standalone workspace with only our mastering modules loaded. Everything you need to finalize single tracks, complete albums, or even live recordings is right there. You can load your tracks or clips into a project either by dragging and dropping them or using the add icon on the clip list. By default, the new Master Match X is loaded into your chain. This tool is great for instant mastering. We'll dive into it later in the video. Here you can see a new feature, on top of the fast browser, the preset browser is now a floating window that includes a ton of go-to chains for various needs. Each of the presets are ready for use for each individual track. The presets are searchable with tags and allow you to quickly find what you need. Once you find something you like, select it, load it direct into your track and start modifying to suit your needs. Here we can see another new feature introduced in T-Rack 6, metering between modules in the chain. This is a great addition for immediate control of your gain staging, leading to better results. Adding or removing modules from your chain is now faster thanks to the search option on the modules list. You can use filters or simply type in a name. Once you find the module, you need drag and drop into the chain either in series or in parallel. You can load up to 16 models if necessary. You can also edit the waveform to fine-tune the start and end of the track, or even insert snapshots. We suggest referring to the manual for more details to keep this video brief. Another new feature added to the mastering console is the master bus. The master bus allows you to control the entire project sound easily. You can quickly check how your master is improving your track using the equal gain and the master bypass. That's very convenient. We've talked about the chain and the sound, but controlling what's going on is an important part of the process. Our famous metering section has been updated for even more customization on top of having a nicer look. In addition to the well-known features related to the individual meters, it's now possible to turn on and off parts of the metering so you can focus on what you prefer while working. This makes it easy to organize your screen according to your needs. This is also true for the single plugin making this new feature accessible for all. And if you have ARC, and if you don't, we suggest you try, you can listen to your track with the correction on thanks to the native integration. As mentioned earlier, you get everything you need to finalize your project, whether it's a single track, an album, or a live recording. The assembly is an easy place to input all your album and track information and rearrange tracks for overlays or gaps. You can divide a live recording into tracks if necessary, finish up a project, and add all the metadata. When you're done, you can quickly export your project or single tracks in various formats and settings. That was the standalone mastering with T-Rack 6, but if you're used to working in your DAO, we got you covered. Using T-Rack 6 in your DAO gives you access to all the models. You can not only master your tracks directly there, but also mix anything in your track. For example, your piano, drums, vocal, bass, or you can search for various effects. There's a tool for everything. Here's an example of mastering a track with a T-Rack 6 plugin. On drum bus, for example.
T-Rack 6 is not a single solution. Integration is key, and you can use any of the 60 available modules whenever and wherever you want. T-Rack 6 comes with eight new modules. They are super intuitive and give you a lot of room for creativity. Let's dive into each one. As mentioned earlier, the default chain loaded in both the Mastering Console and the T-Rack 6 plugin is the new Master Match X. Why? Because it masters your tracks in seconds, based on either built-in references or your loaded references. It's really easy to use. Select your reference and the Master Match X will analyze your mix and master it to match the reference. Then you get some useful macros to customize the result to your taste. It's like mastering wizardy. Check this out. This is the Pusher. It's a great way to dive deep into saturation. Featuring a four-band saturation layout, you can independently tweak your sound in each band. There are five different saturation algorithms to explore from subtle enhancement to bold experimental textures. You can really have some fun with this one. Now onto the base one. This was developed from the popularity of the T-Rax 1 plugin in previous versions, giving you go-to tool for all things low-end. It's made for your master, but you can experiment by putting it on groups or individual tracks to really polish and define those low frequencies with just the turn of a few knobs. This is a cool one, it's called a Delay Lab, and it really is exactly that. It's got all of your delay needs in one simple interface, from your typical space and atmospheric building delays to all-out transformation of your sounds. It's great for leads, vocals, and sound design elements you want to make stand out. There's a lot of room for experimentation here.
Let's check out Channel Strip X. This is going to be your all-in-one essential mix tool. There's presets built in to fit any track you've got like guitars, piano, drums, you name it, and this is your quick path to professional sounding results. Let's check out all the sounds on this kick and this snare. There's a lot to explore in Filter Fusion. You can start off with simple yet essential filtering concept and work your way into some really intricate dynamic filtering patterns. This can be used as both a filter and a really interesting sound design tool. There's a built-in step sequencer to create patterns and rhythms. Let's see how it sounds on different tracks. Now let's take a look at the Lo-Fi Punch. This plugin features two unique Lo-Fi algorithms combining things like compressors, filters, drive, tape tools, and pitch shifting to craft the perfectly imperfect Lo-Fi sound. It's a huge time saver to achieve the highly desired vintage vibe all within this one plugin. You can tweak it just a touch or really crank it up to create some interesting distortions. Now we got the dual spring reverb unit. You can independently track each spring. It's super immersive. You can even choose the materials of each spring to create that classic vintage warmth, a bright sounding modern tone or a mix of somewhere in between. You've got full control over the tone, the length, and the strength of the effects. Check this out. Take charge of your workspace with the introduction of the new Modules Manager. In the Modules Manager, you will be able to decide not only which modules, but also which type of plugin you will find inside your DAW. Here you will also manage your collection and the try option of any new models we will release. There is even more to explore in T-Rack 6, so we suggest you stay tuned to our channels and check out the manual. Try out our intro version if you want to get a closer look for yourself. T-Rack 6, it's made easy. Yeah.